Now, let's answer question from random post at ito ay post ni Sir Prince Tungol II. Patulong po with explanation. I think galing ito sa civil service uh, reviewer, I don't know. Kasi parang nakita ko na to dati na reviewer. Gawin na lang natin ito. Ito yung part 1 natin sa video ito. Tapos sa next na video ay sagutan din natin itong tatlo. Basahin muna natin. A student must choose four subjects out of the pool of eight subjects. Elementary algebra, intermediate algebra, plain geometry, statistics, advanced algebra, calculus, anal analytical geometry, and trigonometry. Given that, elementary algebra is selected. If trigonometry is selected, calculus is selected. If calculus is selected, analytical geometry is selected. If intermediate algebra is selected, analytical geometry is not selected. Number six. If trigonometry is selected, kung iselect daw si trigonometry, which of the following four subjects must be chosen. Balikan natin ito. If trigonometry is selected, calculus is selected. Sa five choices, hanapin muna natin na merong calculus. Kasi sa choices, lahat sila merong trigonometry. So, yung may calculus. Ang may calculus dito ay ito at ito. So, si 1, 2 at itong choice number 4, eliminate na natin. Mag-focus na tayo sa choice 3 at choice 5 na parihong may calculus, parihong may trigonometry. Next. Now, kasi if trigonometry is selected, calculus is selected. So therefore, kapag calculus is selected, analytical geometry is selected. Now, hanapin natin sa dalawa, sa number 3 at sa number 5, kung meron ba dyang analytical geometry. Dito wala siyang analytical. Dito ay meron siyang analytical geometry. So, therefore, ang sagot dito ay itong number 3. Sa number 5, wala siyang analytical geometry. Kasi dapat, if calculus is selected, analytical geometry is selected. Gets nyo ba yun? I-recap lang natin ha, bago tayo mag-proceed para mas lalo nyong maintindihan. Ito yung given. Tapos ang tanong, if trigonometry is selected, which of the following four subjects must be chosen? Lahat sila sa choices may trigonometry. Okay. So, if trigonometry is selected, calculus daw dapat na sineselect din niya. So, kunin natin yung mga subjects or kunin natin sa choices na may calculus. Dalawa lang ang meron sa choice uh, dito sa number 3 at itong choice number 5, may calculus. At pariho silang merong trigonometry. Now, kapag uh, iselect yung calculus, which is dapat mong iselect kapag kukuha ka ng trigonometry, now kapag iselect naman si calculus, dapat meron ding analytical geometry. At sa dalawa, ang analytical geometry ay nandito sa number 3. Wala dito sa number 5. So therefore, ito na yung sagot mo. Number 3. Huwag mo nang isipin yung pang-apat na subject. Kasi for what na isipin mo pa yung pang-apat na subject, kung choice 3 na lang ang natira at na-eliminate na yung iba. So ang sagot sa number 6 ay number 3. By the way, lagi ko nang inuulit ito. Never memorize the answer, kundi yung paraan kung paano natin ito sinagutan. Now, let's do number 7. If intermediate uh, algebra is selected, 
which of the following must be true? Intermediate algebra. Ang nasa given. If intermediate algebra is selected, analytical geometry is not selected. So, dapat walang analytical geometry. Sa choices, choice number one, advanced algebra is not selected. Wala namang advanced algebra dito sa given mismo. So, eliminate natin yan. Number two, trigonometry is selected. Take note, if trigonometry is selected, we have to select calculus. Now, if we have to select calculus, we have to select analytical geometry. And remember, if we select uh, intermediate algebra, analytical geometry is not selected. So, 100% na wrong ang number 2. Choice 3. Calculus is not selected. So, kung calculus is not selected... And dito is calculus is selected hanggang kung mag-select ka kasi, ka kasi ng calculus, dapat may analytical geometry. Now, if calculus is not selected, of course, wala ring analytical geometry. Therefore, this is acceptable or this sentence is true. Basahin muna natin yung number four. Statistic is not selected. Hindi naman yan naka-mention. Plain algebra, uh, geometry is not selected. Hindi rin naka-mention. So, ang sagot sa number 7 ay itong number 3. Calculus is not selected. Anyway, lalagay ko sa description ng video ito yung mga tips regarding sa logical reasoning kasi pariho lang din naman yan. Bali, mag-stick ka lang sa mismong given. At abangan sa next na video regarding dito sa basic operations. Thank you.